After all seven Hokie wrestlers won in round one, it was then time to compete in primetime for a spot in the quarterfinals. Joey Dance kept up the momentum for the Hokies by earning a 12-2 major decision over the number 15 seed, Drew Templeman. Solomon Chisco then brought all the Hokies in the Scott Trade Center to its feet when he nailed his first pin of the season at the biggest stage thus far. In the 157 weight class, number 14 seed Sal Mastriani had the number 3 seed tied entering sudden victory until Mastriani was pinned in a good move by his opponent. Zach Epperly then took to the mat, earning himself a 5-2 decision to advance to the next round. Shortly thereafter, number 5 seed Zach Zavatsky was upset by number 12 seed Drew Foster in a close match 4-3. At the 197 weight class, Jared Halt was maybe the most consistent person of the night, winning both his morning and evening bouts 4-1. At heavyweight, Ty Walls put an end to the hard-working day by a bidding score of 9-5. At the conclusion of day one, the Hokies went 12-2 and five Hokies will play in the quarterfinals tomorrow morning. Sal Mastriani and Zach Zavatsky will play in the consolations bracket where All-American honors and a third place finish are still on the table. By the time the Hokies had finished wrestling, they had moved to number six in the team scores. Tomorrow morning's quarterfinals and consolation rounds will begin at 11 a.m. Eastern and can be watched on ESPNU and all eight mats can be viewed on Watch ESPN. But for now, good night from St. Louis.